WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. We've got a mixed bag out there. That mix goes like this. You've got the Dow up 137. The transport's up 44. New York Stock Exchange is up 17. The other U.S. indices that we track trading in the downside. S&P's off seven points, a little uh, more than one-tenth of a percent, six-tenths for the uh, NASDAQ 100, 114 points there, a quarter percent for the Russell, a five-point move, and the semis are off two and a third, two and three-tenths percent, 110 points to the downside. Gold's off six bucks, silver's off 18 pennies, and the U.S. dollar index is up five cents. You've got lights recruit up 83 cents, natural gas up a nickel, 30 year treasury up 13 ticks. And uh, let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel. Market update chart, upper left hand corner, the ES mini. We just got a consolidation with inside its daily profile. That's between the range of 5167 and support, 5257 for resistance. We're keeping our eye on that spot volatility. Why? It's approaching the 50 day exponential moving average. The 50 days at 14, price at 1409. A close below 14 would suggest a further rally in the ES mini with price target in the 5257 level out there. The NQ still trading with inside its bearish structured daily profile that so far has really proven to be nothing more than a counter trend move to the downside and that's because price found support at the center of that bearish structure profile 18026 if we take a look at the US dollar index it's on the move it's trading above the top of its daily profile it's trading above the center right now of its bullish structured weekly profile that's suggesting that the US dollar index may want to go target the 10419 level if it does that we're likely to see uh, the gold future contract move back to the 2109 area that's the bottom of its bearish structured daily profile Profile. Silver did form a new profile this morning. Resistance up at 2551. Support down at 2436. In the case of lights we crude, it's got an A to B equal CD to the upside. It's going to go target that 1.272 expansion. And that's in the 8418 level. The only thing that would generate a top out here would be a bearish reversal candle. And then we'd see some type of Gartley sell pattern. Natural gas is on the move this morning. The key level here for natural gas, we are looking at the May contract, is at the 1.922 level. If natural gas can, and it does have a buy the D point pattern, that buy the D point pattern formed back on February 16th, it reconfirmed that on March the 14th out there. And now the key is can price get inside resistance, above resistance, the bottom of that profile at 1.922. And finally, the 30 year treasury got back, tested its swing point from back in February, and uh, today it's rejecting that level, 118.09. Could be a signal that the U.S. Treasuries are getting ready to rally. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Said Show. If you're out to start your Tuesday, please have a terrific one. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.